Alrighty guys, welcome back to a new video. This is my first video in 2024 for me. But this is going to be my gaming setup tour. I'm going I'm going to do one every single year. So like the start of every single year. I'm going to try to. Then I'm going to say like three things that I want to upgrade on my gaming setup, which is just over there for me. And three things that I want to achieve on this channel this year. So let's get to it. We'll do the gaming setup first. Alrighty, so over here, I've got this uh, gaming chair. Got it for Christmas. Much better than a very, very, a very, very old janky chair. I'll actually bring that in and show you. I used to have this. This was my old chair, but now I've got that gaming one. It's pretty cool. Definitely a massive upgrade from this. This is also like ripped up and that. So I've showed you the chair, but once you actually sit down, you've got the actual setup. So over here, you've got this keyboard. Next year, actually, by the end of next year, I want this upgraded because it's a little. Not really. Yeah. Not really that great. It's RGB. It's an upgrade. Before this, I had this boring as Dell keyboard. Now I just have it sitting in my desk. Um, it's wireless, so I just use it whenever, whenever I just move my monitor over to my bed. Then I just watch Netflix. But we've also got this um Acer Nitro gaming monitor. I love it. It's great. Um. This is probably the most expensive thing on my desk, the like monitor. Hopefully, by this year, it shouldn't be. <laughs> because I do want to save up for a new laptop. Um, because I've got this thing over here. I have a sneaking suspicion that it was used as a school laptop because I tried to go on some, like, certain gaming websites. It's blocked. Why? Probably because this, it used to probably be a school laptop. I got it for very cheap. I'm saving up for one. I'm more than halfway there. I'll show you the specs, they're pretty bad. So I've got an Intel M37Y30. That's only one gigahertz. And I'm a task manager. Apparently it's using 100% of the CPU. Why? I don't even know why. Just don't ask. And we've got eight gigs of RAM, then the Wi-Fi. That's not really, that's, yeah, we've actually upgraded our Wi-Fi this year. Although the Wi-Fi in my room is not good. I just clicked on it and the GPU said it just went up. Integrated graphics, Intel HD graphics, 615 or 615 or whatever. I tried to go onto Fortnite. Also this laptop screen, not even 1080p, not 720p. It's like really weird. It's like 1366 by like 768, which is really weird. The laptop needs an upgrade. I will upgrade that. I'm on the way, I'm more than halfway. I'll show you the laptop that I'm saving up for. But then I've got my mouse over here. Okay, this, this, and this all came in a bundle. Um, we were at the show, got it for 25 bucks. No wonder why the keyboard look flimsy. I'm gonna upgrade that. The mouse, I don't really want to upgrade it because it's got an auto clicker right here and I can just hold it. Um, yeah, it, it's cool enough. Auto clicker. I, I mainly, I don't really want to upgrade it because it's got an auto clicker. You know? Although I don't really use it much. If I need to, then I can. If I, especially if I'm playing like Cookie Clicker, mouse mat standard. But I'm gonna go show you the laptop that I'm saving up for. So here it is over here. It's got an Intel Core i5, um, 1235U, Intel Iris Xe graphics, same amount of RAM, same amount of storage. This laptop though actually has Windows 11 Pro, probably worth more than the laptop. Um, it comes with Windows 11, Windows 11 Home, and yes, that is Australia, um, buy new, 
680 bucks plus $40 shipping, so it's basically $720, which is, yeah, I don't know. The thing is, there's like more intensive games where it's like, this thing would struggle to run it, but then they're on console, and I've actually got a Series X, so, and I've got a Game Pass, so it's not really that big of a deal. But the games that I want to run, like PC exclusive ones, it's like my summer car, BMMG. Oh, you need a, you need a NASA computer. No, I can run normal settings easily with this thing. My dad had a um, what an i5, uh, Intel Core i5, twelfth, tenth gen laptop. Um, integrated graphics, same amount of RAM, probably more storage though, and it was made by Asus as well. And it ran on West Coast USA, the most resourceful map in the game pretty smoothly so and it's newer as well like my summer car i don't think they'll be too hard to run but yeah time to get onto what i want to achieve but before i do that speaker system i want to get a soundbar there because this monitor doesn't come with inbuilt speakers it's just running off that laptop pretty tinny I want a soundbar, but all right, time to get on to what I want to achieve this year. Well, so here's the achievements that I want to achieve this year for this YouTube channel. Number one, getting to 300 subscribers. That sounds pretty realistic. I'm nearly at 200 and Exactly a year from now, I was only at 31, so I think I should probably easily get to 300. So that's number one. Number two is to just not take as many breaks. As you've seen, I could just be uploading, I'm on fire, then I just don't upload for a month, and then I better upload. I need to fix that, I'm sorry. There was one, there was one time where, um... I wanted to upload, but I just physically couldn't. Or, well, YouTube wouldn't let me. You may have seen, if you're subscribed to my channel, or you were a couple of months ago, I uploaded a video, and basically it got deleted. And then I got a strike, and I could not I couldn't upload for like a month. But then... I, th I thought it was over. I thought I was going to have to create a whole new channel. Because it just wouldn't... Like, I would press the plus button. It wouldn't let me. Like, it wouldn't It wouldn't let me try to... It, it even got to a point where it wouldn't even let me make a little post. Like, a post is all just, like, text or, like, an image. I couldn't even do that at one point. And, um... So, yeah, now my channel's got one strike. Um, I've gotten removed from some of my features, like special features, like, oh, multiple live streams in one day, and maybe, I think, a custom URL page, which I'm pretty mad about, I, I think. I'm going to have to check that. But, um, yeah, that, that wasn't really in my control. I didn't think that video was going to get deleted. I made an appeal um, because they reported it um, for the wrong reason as well. Um, I made an appeal. I was being pretty calm and chill about it, but I, yeah, I was, I'm now stuck with a strike and like, oh, most channels won't get two strikes. Um, I'm just hoping I don't get any more because if I'm at two, then I'm on the verge of having my channel deleted. Because if you get to three, if you don't know, your channel gets deleted. But for number three, the final one, the what I want to achieve on this channel this year is 250,000 views. Like in total, just this year, 250,000. You may say, huh, that's, that's a lot. And especially considering that you've got... It's a really small channel. Well, this year I've got legitimately 110,000 views. Oh, well, last year I did in total. The year before that I got about like 3,000 or 4,000. 
I know that was only like two and a half months, but still, I got 110,000 this year, and if my channel grows even more, which I'm, I'm hoping that it will, I hope it doesn't just get stuck. Um, at 31 subscribers, because it got stuck at that for a while, then my channel just flew. Or well, for me, it did. Um, but I'll show you proof. Like right here. I've got 110,000 views this year, or well, last year, I should say now. That, that's crazy. I just want to say thank you. But, yeah, and these are reasonable ones. I'm not saying 100,000 subscribers, uh, 100 million views. No, I'm, I'm not saying that. The breaks, yes, I, I need to work on that. Um, I won't, I'm not going to probably upload daily if I do it will be just mostly short sometimes videos shorts they just bring more views and i'm not saying i don't like making videos you know um but it just brings in more views and you know helps grow um the channel which when you're a small channel it does help a lot but videos i mean they can take more time you can get like five views you know which that's just how YouTube is on a small channel. What did I expect? But yeah, that, then don't really expect there to be too much editing in this video. It's not like the, the best editing of all time. No, it's going to be very plain and simple. Like just, you know, cutting some bits out, just like one image pop up, you know? You know, the right time. I got a Dorito. Can't see it though, but you guys can. Well, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye!